Hello, dear AI enthusiasts. What if I tell you that from today on, you no longer have to laboriously write code, but can generate it in seconds, faster than you can type, hello world, and all of this for a fraction of the cost you usually pay for large models? Sounds like a nerdy dream, right? Wrong! This is Mercury Coder from Inception Labs, and I promise you, this thing will blow you away. It's up to 10 times faster and 10 times cheaper than the language models you know and it could completely change your life as a coder, tinkerer, or AI fan. No mood for boring explanations. Stay tuned anyway, because I'll show you right now how it works, why it's so crazy, and how you can try it yourself, with some wild examples that will definitely captivate you. Okay, let's not waste time and get started right away. You surely know the usual suspects like GPT-4 or Claude. These models work like diligent little typewriters, token by token, step by step, until the code is ready. Works? Sure but it sometimes feels like watching a snail race. Mercury Coder plays in a completely different league. It uses diffusion, a technique you might know from image generators like stable diffusion. Imagine you have an image full of noise, pixel chaos everywhere, and then it gradually becomes clearer until a masterpiece emerges. Mercury does that with text. It starts with wild text noise and forms clean functional code from it in several parallel steps. It's like throwing a pile of Lego bricks in the air and they land perfectly as a spaceship. And because everything happens simultaneously, it's insane. Over 1,000 tokens per second on an NVIDIA H100 GPU. For comparison, GPT-40 Mini might manage 200 to 300 tokens. That's like a bicycle competing against a jet. Mercury wins, hands down. But how exactly does it work? Let's zoom in. Let's say you give Mercury the prompt, write me a Python function that sorts a list. Normal models would leisurely start def, then sort list, then brackets, and so on, like a retiree writing a letter. Mercury, however, does it differently. It first spits out a kind of rough draft, and then zap, zap, zap. It becomes finished code in seconds. I tested it myself, and I swear my jaw dropped. I asked Mercury to write me a particle effect for HTML5 canvas. You know, those cool particles that follow the mouse. With controls for speed and color. Entered the prompt, pressed enter, and bam, the code was there. Ran immediately, without error messages. I sat there thinking, what the hell just happened? This thing flashed me so much that I tested it three times in a row, just to make sure I wasn't dreaming. Now it gets a bit nerdy, but stay with me, because this is the point where it gets really exciting. Mercury Coder is based on mathematical models, from image generation. The AI denoises the text by keeping the entire context in view, not just the previous tokens, as in autoregressive models. And this means fewer errors, more consistency, hardly any hallucinations. If a normal model makes an error, say it forgets a bracket, it can't go back. Mercury, on the other hand, optimizes the whole thing as if it were running the code through a magic filter. And here's a fact that will blow you away. Mercury Coder Mini is so efficient that it even runs on an old MacBook with a slow GPU. I tried it. Flask server code with routing and database connection in 8 seconds, locally without internet. For people like you who like to tinker offline or don't want to pay for expensive cloud services, this is like a gift from the AI heavens. Let me tell you a little story that shows how crazy this is. I asked Mercury to write a Boyd's algorithm. Do you know them? These are swarm simulations where points fly like birds, repel and attract. Totally realistic. My prompt was, write me a Boyd's algorithm with Pygame 50 particles, realistic movement. I thought it would take a few minutes, but no. In six seconds, I had not only the code, but also a brief explanation of the forces, repulsion, alignment, attraction. I started the thing and the points flew across the screen, so hypnotizing that I almost spilled my coffee. After that, I played around. More particles, other speeds, change colors. Mercury spat out every adjustment in no time. This wasn't just an AI, it felt like a creative partner. I spent hours with it, just because it was so much fun. And that's the point. Mercury is not just fast, it makes you addicted to experimenting. But wait, it gets even better. Imagine you want to build an AI agent that writes code for you or automates boring tasks. Maybe an app that sorts your shopping list up or analyzes data. With Mercury, the agent delivers results instantly instead of making you wait for minutes. Or think about Edge. Hey, computing. Mercury is so lightweight that it runs on your laptop without problems. I bet with a bit of optimization, you could even get it running on a Raspberry Pi. Imagine controlling smart lights or outlets by voice or local without cloud. I tested it with another example. Write me a script that loads CSV data, calculates a trend, and displays it in Matplotlib. Result? In five seconds, I had a linear regression for 10,000 rows of data perfectly plotted. I fed that thing with absurd amounts of data, 50,000 rows, 100,000 rows, 
And Mercury didn't even flinch. This is not just technology, it's magic. And because I know you're probably just as curious as I am, here's a bonus. Mercury could completely revolutionize the way we use AI. The diffusion technique is like a glimpse into the future. Faster, leaner, smarter. I even tried to give Mercury something completely off the wall. Write me a script for a minigame where a spaceship dodges asteroids. In 10 seconds, I had a working game with Pi Gamma, control with arrow keys, collision detection, all included. I played it and laughed because I couldn't believe it was that easy. That's the moment when you realize Mercury is not just a tool, it's a playground for your ideas. To wrap up, one more little nudge. Mercury Coder is more than just a fast code generator. It's an invitation to get creative and test the boundaries. The diffusion technique could soon overtake everything we know, and you can be part of it now. Jump over to chat.inceptionlabs.ai, sign up, and get started. I bet you'll be just as hooked as I am. And hey, leave me a comment. Tell me what you're building with it, whether it's a crazy project or just a useful script. I'm curious what you'll make of it. If you like this update, then leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you activate the bell, you'll even be informed when we upload a new video. I hope to see you next time. Until then, stay real.